they're big, strong, physical guys that take you where they want to go. It wasn't the Boston Celtics night against the Philadelphia 76ers. The Seas were without Evan Fournier, but they were able to keep the game close in the first quarter. But in the second, Philly went on a 19-2 run to take a 13-point lead at the half. Despite the Celtics trying to close the gap, Philly was the more physical team as the Celtics committed 20 turnovers in the Sixers' 106-96 victory. Um, it's hard to have that many turnovers and win and beat a team like that. Um, along with some other things that we did or didn't do tonight, um, but it was kind of key from all of us, you know, that we just got to take care of the ball. They're big, strong, physical guys that take you where they want to go. Um, Simmons has always been a handful on the block. Um, Embiid, handful on the block. Harris, you know, to his credit, I think has improved down there. But they all three play a real physical brand of basketball. I mean, at the end of the day, you just have to adjust. You have to adapt. It's like this for everyone. Um, it's, it's tough. It's a hard year. It's been a very, very tough year for everybody. You know, you just gotta try to find a way, man. That's, that's all you can do. You know, when, when guys go down, you gotta expect guys to kind of step step their games up and help other guys, you know, play better. Yeah, man, you know, it's just been a tough year overall for everyone. So, you know, we're not secluded. We're not alone in that. Jason Tatum also said post game the Celtics just need to move on to the next one and focus on their back to back. Now, luckily, Tristan Thompson is expected to make his return for tomorrow night's matchup against the New York Knicks.